Okay, so hello everyone. Today we're going to be unboxing the Pokemon Sun and Moon Cosmic Eclipse Elite Trainer Box. This is my first ever Elite Trainer Box, and I had to get Cosmic Eclipse as soon as I saw the set. It has parts of Team Up from the Japanese set. No, not Team Up. Dream League, which is an amazing set, which has a Rosa card. Rosa being the main female character of Pokemon Black and White 2, which are my favourite Pokemon games. So, of course, I have to get that but there's also a bunch of pokemon and trainer cards which is really awesome especially with pokemon masters you know driving home the whole idea of sync pairs so today we're going to be opening it i'm actually going to do this in two parts the first part i'll do today and the second part i'll do tomorrow today's christmas day now that what that will just be one video but i'll there'll be two put cards where i'll cut and then i'll do the rest because opening pokemon cards is really fun so i've got to somehow work around my light setup to actually get this bad boy out of the box it's actually going to be quite hard to you know get open it has dialga palkia and arceus on the front it's a very Sinnoh by set Sinnoh by sun and moon sets ironically always seem to be my favorite i remember ultra prism which is a set i still collect for because i want the lily full or you know but i think with that i might just wait till it goals that are playing the official tcg like next year and then just buy it but i've never opened an elite trainer box before but it's full of so many goodies i'm not i don't play the tcg so i'll just take a look at the box real quick got pokemon sun moon cosmic eclipse elite trainer box the elite trainer box is in there so as you can see at the apex of the sun and moon series the pokemon tcg sun and moon cosmic eclipse expansion boosts the connection of pokemon and trainers and it launches tag team combinations to new levels jumping to battle of charizard and breaks and venusaur and snivy blastoise and piplup solgaleo and lunala along with triple tag team of arceus dialga and palkia and many more for the stellar power of pokemon with the sun and moon expansion so this comes with eight train eight booster packs of cosmic eclipse 65 sleeves with arceus garatina no, not Garatina, Diablo and Palkia, 45 energy cards, a player's guide, damage counters, one die, two acrylic um, markers, a collector's box, and a cold card, which I'm going to give you guys the cold card. I don't know how many of you actually play the TC. Ooh, so if you look in there, you can see, I don't know if you, I don't want to open it, but you can kind of see if I move that. You can kind of see in there like a bit and as you can see they've got all the different pack artworks so that's actually quite cool as a sleeve you have the player's guide which i assume explains to you how to play the tcg Solgaleo and lunala on the front oh it has most of the cards i think that's another good card with lily does it have like a full set sheet wow it kind of does so there's a lot of cards, and I'm hoping with the eight packs we can... There's also a bunch of good tag teams. So that's the collector's... No, player's guide. Yeah, I've never brought an Elite Trainer box. I wanted to. I don't play the TCG, but maybe that's just because I have no one to play with. So look at this. We get this, I'm assuming, just holds it off. You have the different counters, the GX Poison. You have a bunch of dice. Oh, wow, that's in pretty neatly. This is just kind of a thing that holds it. You have all of these packs. Eight. So you have Blastoise. Yeah, look at all these. Some of these feel heavy. So I'm hoping for some good pulls in these eight. Then you also have the cold card, which you guys can have. So whoever claims that, claims that. I hope you get good things in the TCG online. You have these, which are deck dividers, I believe. Because you can use this as your deck. And this is the energy cards. So I'm not going to open it. Um, and these are the sleeves right here. So they have Arceus, Garatina. No, I keep saying Garatina. And I'm just going through Sinnoh Legends. So we'll get these out if we get good pulls. So as I said, we're going to be opening up four packs now. And then I'm going to open up four packs later. Because Pokemon cards are awesome. So this goes right down to that. It's like really tiny. Wow. So put that to the side. Okay. So how many of each pack artwork do we actually have? We have one, two of each. So I think we're going to start with a this pack that has Arceus, Dialga, Palkia on it. So that's the first pack look, hopefully. Hopefully we'll get something kind of cool in it. As I said, trainer cards are the main 
thing that I want and the Rosa card would be much appreciated if we could get that. But I know trainer cards, oh gosh, don't tell me I'll cut into like a pack because that would probably make me really sad. No, I don't think we did. You just got to be careful because some of these are pined open. Some of them open really easily and then other packs you'll have just won't open and you'll just, you won't understand why. Alright, so I don't know what side the cold card is. I want to say it's the front. Um, no it isn't. So, cold cards are actually from the back. Oh crap, well we saw that cold card. So it means pretty good. I think it's free to the back. I don't know, it might be free to the front. So we start with the... Oh, I think we got something pretty good on our first pack. So let me just sort this out so you can actually see. So we got Fire Energy. Let me just zoom in on it so you can see. Fire Energy, Tropius, Togedomaru, Absol. Oh, jeez. This is not... Just trying to get it so you can like fully see it. Trapinch, Flabebe, Tangela, Duskull, and Iglybuff. Is Iglybuff the main card? No! Ooh! We got the Sogaleo and Lunala card with Lily on the first pack, so GG. <laughs> GG with that. That's an awesome card. You know, Lily is one of the best Pokemon characters, I think. And her connection with Solgaleo and Lunella. Just. So yeah. First pack. And we already got a pretty good card. Has Cosmic Burn and Light of Protector GX. That is a good card. I'm happy we got that. That is wow. That is good. So. That is a really good pull. And we got some pretty cool Pokemon as well. Because. My collection. Alright. So our first pack went really well. Now we're going to open up. Um, a. Blastoise and Piplup pack. Trying to like have it so I can actually see everything that's going on. And you can see everything that's going on in, you know, the pack. But we know it's the front is where the magic happens. But, okay. Oh, is there something else in there that I didn't get to? Oh, wow. We actually didn't get the last card, which was another Togedomaru. <laughs> oh, so yeah. Oh, this is actually pretty good. And I, I, yeah, I want to open up half. I might buy more elite trainer boxes in the future if the pulls are pretty good. But they are quite expensive. This is like the price of a Switch game, honestly. Which I guess is the question of is it really worth it? Like, if you're not a hardcore player of the TCG, like I just collect them because they look nice. Oh, so we got a green cold card. So this could be our first. Not bad, but like not we're not getting like an insane card. Alright. So green cold card for the second one. I'll try and keep tabs on what we get. Free to the front. And we'll see when we start getting dupes. Because eventually do <laughs> speaking of dupes, first straight away we get a normal Iggly buff card. We get Pyro, which is awesome, male Pyro. Hakumo'o, which is, you know, that's a cool middle evolution. Magnemite, it's also cool when you get Pokemon you actually like. Eevee, which is the card I kind of saw at the start. Flabaybay, looking very sad. Sneasel, Sneasel looked quite cute. I got a shiny Sneasel yesterday in Pokemon Go. Natu, Rotom. Oh, Mimikyu and uh, Electric Heart Energy. That's a really cool Mimikyu card. It's quite realistic. This is, this is fun, you know. It's just the pressure of having the camera on and making sure the quality looks good because, you know, recording off your phone, the quality isn't always the best. But I want to keep tabs on what we've got, what we've pulled in each pack. So I'm kind of going to keep a tab on that. Okay, next up is the Solgaleo and Lunala pack. Is the next one we're opening up. I keep having to... Because I've got really no space of how I'm filming at the moment to put my arms. None of these packs want to open straight away. I mean, that's fine. I'm kind of glad I waited. Because I was actually going to go and pick up a pack of these, but I didn't. And it might have been worth it for this set, man. Because we already got a really good 
card, at least for me, because, you know, I'm a huge Lily fan, and so Galeo. The Lily Figma, as I've said, it will come out, I don't know when it will come out, it's because I want to get a mic, so I can connect it up to here to get the best audio quality. We're not going to look at the code card. I'll throw it on the floor. Oh, Seville. Wow, we've got Seville. I like Seville. Seville's cool. All right, third pack. Start with a Rapidash. Start with a Rapidash. Vibrava. Probal Pass. Sorry about if you can't really see it too well. Oh, like how it is. Seville. Cottony. Rowlet, my boy, I love Rowlet. He's like my favourite Pokemon. Phantom. Alolan Grimer. Woobat. And the final card is... Lunala. Wow, that's a pretty cool Lunala card. And then Fighting Type Energy. So, yeah, we got pretty good pulls on the first pack. I kind of want to open more of these, but they're, they're expensive. I'm, I get paid, like, £20 at work, like, work a week. I work in retail, so, like, two weeks' worth of work could get me one of these every, like, twice a month. But there's other stuff I want, too, like an iMac, as I've said. Okay, last of the four we're going to open today. Then the next one will be in the next part, but, of course, it'll be in the same video for all of you. Sorry about that. There was a cut. I had to delete a few things, but it's the last pack of this set well not this set this part but yeah we got i'm excited man ball guy no not ball guy <laughs> this isn't so much old bell bell and bryson man see black and white two getting love in this set i mean bryson man they should have done princess rosa as a card so i keep having cuts <laughs> i'm sorry but we're gonna do this real quick just you know delmoise kartik swell helioptile Cosmog because Nebby is best Nebby. Slug my nuts. Wildmer. Ponyard. Ooh, we got Flannery and Torkoal. Sync Pair and Pokemon Masters and a pretty cool card at that. Marshadow. I've never had a Marshadow card. And Energy. So, yeah. Second out of the four packs, we've got two pretty good pulls. So, let me just slot that in there. Okay, so then we'll open up another four packs. And you'll it'll be straight after for you, but for me it'll be the next day. So yeah. Okay, so we're back. I kind of lied when I said I was gonna wait till tomorrow because I realised that I probably will end up sleeping. And I've just I couldn't help myself. I just need to see what else we get. I probably should wait, but I feel like I won't sleep and I've got work tomorrow, so I kinda have to. So yeah, we're gonna get back on these, hoping for some good polls. Hopefully we don't have any cutouts. So I do want to be quite quick here. We're starting with the Solgaleo and Lunala pack. The second one, maybe it'll give us luck. Nope, once again, needs the scissors. It seems like they all do. Then I end up losing the scissors and I can't find them, but quickly we'll just snip the top off. Of course, we would be happy with any cool card. Make sure we don't see the front. The front really does spoil quite a bit without the card. So you might be able to see on screen what it is. I'm purposely not. Oh crap, I kind of saw that. And then free to the front. Will mimic you hiding away. Be still. Another Cosmog. Ponyta, so that's a full evolution line. Cabrola. Kavana, looking very scary. Chinchu. Tangela, and Makago. So I'm assuming green cold card on that one. Yup. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. You probably saw like all the mess that I have on my desk at the moment because there is actually quite a lot of mess. Next up is Blastoise and Piplup. Yeah, I'm really enjoying this. I might have to do another one of these because this really is a fun thing to do. 
That's the thing about getting Pokemon cards is even once you've opened them, you still got something fun. I mean, I mean it as like Christmas presents because it's like most Christmas presents, once you've opened it, you're like, try not to look at these cold cards so they don't want to get spoiled. You might be able to see, I hope not. Alright, pull it all out. Alright. Do three to the front. Lilip. Jolteon, that's a pretty cool Jolteon card. Pangoro, absolutely destroying the ground. Azumarill's Woolly World. Rufflet. Oddish. I don't think I've ever actually had an Oddish card. Rolts. We love Rolts. Sandygast. Carvana. And. Heliop Heliolisk. So is that another green? Yep, another green cold card. So we might be. We might have already got the good stuff in the first two packs, but. That's fine with me, if the, even if we only get two. All right, now we're going on to the cosmic, the babies pack, as I call it. Because there's the three babies on it. Togepi, Wiggly, no, not Wigglytuff, Igglybuff, Cleffa. All right, so hopefully we can get some, that's like not going to come out, is it? Alright, what's the front one? Technically me doing that doesn't really matter. Oh, glad it's still recording. I'm getting quite worried that we're just going to go off, so I'm going to be quick. Torkoal, so that's without Flannery. Bloom, getting the full evolution line here. Floet, Onyx, Tepig, A, I love Tepig. Alone Sun True Snow Runt Coughing Wyoma Alone the Muck is that the last one? Yep. Okay, so down to our last pack now. We have not got we have not got another white cold card, so hopefully we will, but if we don't, you know. We still had good polls today. And I'm still very grateful. The fact that I even got this box and you know the pulls that we've got so far have been winners in their own right. So it would be disappointing sure if we weren't to get like another rare card. But it wouldn't be the end of the world. Oh Drillba, I do like Drillba. We seem to get a lot of core Pokemon that I just never had cards of before. Start with Zangoose, Vaporeon, we're getting all of the um, evolutions, Tag Cell, Drillba, Swirlix, Cricketot, Wubat again, Ducklet, Jolteon, and the final card is Lycan Rock. So, apparently that was good, so... That was all the cards we got. We got out of the eight packs, the highlights are a GX and one tag team card, not tag team, sync pair card. So, yeah, that's not exactly. So, we're just finishing off here to delete some else. So, overall, we got the highlights of this Elite Trainer box were a GX and a Trainer and Pokemon card. We didn't exactly get anything else, but I'm still happy with what we got. We got quite a few, cool few evolution lines complete. So thank you for watching. I uh, maybe in the future we'll do another one of these. I kind of want to, but more of this set will be on the way eventually. So check out them. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.